This is a presentation about presentations. I'm not going to cover everything about presentations in this presentation, but hopefully I'll cover a couple of points you can use. The thing about most presentations is that they're really hard to follow. That's because most people put way too many words on a page and use themes or random ways of highlighting type that make the page hard to read. They try to break those words up with bullet points, but it usually doesn't work because the bullet points end up being too long to actually count as bullet points. It really gets hard to read when the presenter starts talking about something that isn't on the page, expounding on a point. People start to drift because they can't find where you are. They're looking for the words. They're not paying attention to what you're saying anymore. So why do people put so many words on a page? Basically, most people make the presentation so that slides can be left as a handout, so they don't want to leave anything out. But handouts are handouts, and presentations are presentations. They're different animals altogether. So, you can make your presentation the way you always have, or you can engage the brains of your audience. You see, the brain is configured to take what we see and combine it with what we hear, which means that what you say is a narration. The pictures reinforce your points, and your audience understands, and that makes them happy. Think about it. How many movies have the printed script of the movie on the screen in the theater? None. Neither should your presentation. You can do a lot with pictures. If something is big, you can use a metaphor. If it's really big, you can use a really big metaphor. You can use all the human emotions to help people remember your story, even if you don't use humans. Humor works. Fear works. Some weird combination of the two also works. We call that surprise. The key is to engage both the eyes and the ears so the brain works the way it's used to working and the audience stays happy and follows along. But what about the notes? What about the handout? Simple. Use the notes view to print your presentation. That way the pictures keep their value and all your notes stay connected with them. Thanks for watching.